All right, what's up you guys? Just leaving the library. That's my new temporary office. Um, so wanted to take time to tell everyone that I'm gonna start doing a vlog. Um, and I think it's really important because my personality kicks ass and um, I just, there's a lot going on in my life right now in a very, very good way. Um, business is booming, kind of. Um, and I've never been so excited about where I'm headed because, I don't know, I think, as a lot of you know, my mom passed away about two months ago now. Um, and obviously there was a, a week long or, well, I'm not even gonna say an amount of time because there was a period where I was just very, very upset and wasn't sure what to do next um, in terms of my career and like work and this and that. Uh, it took a while to just get comfortable even leaving the house to do things other than mourn. Um, but uh, needless to say, my mom has basically become the fire under my ass, as I put it, because uh, her passing has basically kept me moving every day. And that's mostly because I decided that it would be best to continue her legacy and continue making her proud. Um, as a lot of you know, and as I've said in some of my Facebook posts and Instagram posts, um, every time I would visit my mom at her house um, and stay for however long it was, uh, right before walking out the door, she would always tell me how proud she was of me. And she would always joke, well, at least I did something right. Um, and I will always remember that about her, that she was so proud and it didn't matter what it was. Um, I don't know. I mean, she was just so proud of my sister and I and never held back from admitting that and telling us straight to our face. And that's one of the best things that I could ever, um, you know, ask for or even witness is seeing my mom so proud of my sister and I just living our lives the way we do. And, you know, remembering my mom in that way is the best because it always, you know, I just always remember her as such a happy and thankful person. Um, so anyway, I wanted to start this vlog, this vlog because uh, ever since her passing, a lot of stuff has been happening, but most importantly, um, in the past like two weeks, uh, I shot Miami Music Week this year for a record label in New York City, uh, Deep Root Records. They're super awesome, great bunch of guys, um, fun to work with, you know, fun events, everything. Um, and when I shot for them down in Miami, I uh, did my networking and handed out my awesome flashy business cards and uh, met an Australian vocalist named Bella Hunter. Um, I heard she was gonna be in New York the following week, so I linked up with her and shot for her for a day in New York. And then um, she took me to an event uh, where one of her best friends um, basically held this event for like a coalition of awesome like powerful business women um, so it was just me in this gin ginormous room of you know like 50 women and I stuck out like a sore thumb but I kept my cool uh, but she mentioned she was throwing a Coachella party so I contacted her and that led to me just last night uh, Monday night um, booking my flight out to Palm Springs where I'm gonna be shooting her party at Coachella and networking even more. Um, aside from that, I've been shooting for my friend Yana who is a fitness model. And today alone, I woke up and just all this stuff, amazing stuff happened. Like one of my fraternity brothers called me from the city and said there was a production assistant gig that I could uh, help out with on Monday in New York City. So I'll be doing that on Monday. And then I also got a random, uh, well, not random so much, but finally got a response from a company I had applied to in the city uh, via Facebook. Um, 
always put your info out there and apply to everything because at some point they might actually call you back and need you. And I finally got that shot and now I'm gonna be uh, going to the city on Tuesday also. Keep in mind I live on Eastern Long Island so it's like a two hour commute each way, but it's all about hustle mode. And I am learning that hustling and putting your name out there instead of sitting at home and wondering why you're not being successful, hustling is like so key in happiness and you know, just literally getting shit done. I mean, it makes sense. Hustle is hustle for a reason. So anyway, um, yeah, I've got that on Tuesday and it's a dance studio um, that could, that only wants my help like Mondays and Tuesdays right now after this trial period on Tuesday. Um, but they said it, they would like it to lead to a full-time position and me being their in-house uh, videographer. So sooner than later, I'm gonna be moving into the city and hopefully a lot of stuff like this will start happening. Um, that's, my, that's my plan. And also to throw into that mix of crazy schedule-ness, uh, so I fly out to Coachella tomorrow, Wednesday. Today's Tuesday. Uh, I fly out tomorrow on Wednesday. I sh drive down to San Diego to say hello to the boys and, and girls um, that I know from living there in 2016. Um, hang out with them, spend the night, and then drive back up to Coachella slash Indio um, slash Palm Springs in, on Thursday afternoon. Um, shoot the party for Michelle uh, Thursday night and then Friday I get to meet up with my friend Bella who I think I mentioned earlier uh, the musician from Miami Music Week the vocalist um, I meet up with her I do a desert photo shoot I shoot her performance at lunchtime and then Friday night I fly out get here at 5 a.m. Saturday morning literally go home just to shower and then drive out to Southampton, which is like a half hour, 45 minutes away from where I live. Uh, do some more shooting for my friend Tori, who owns a dance studio out there. And yeah, that's my life nowadays. So I'm kind of pumped. Um, sorry, this video is seven minutes, almost eight minutes long, but wanted to catch everyone up, bring you up to speed. I am so incredibly pumped and driven and just happy about life right now and i always think about my mom in a positive way and that she is probably so darn proud of me uh that i'm doing what i do and i have reason to believe that you know sometimes when i get these crazy uh you know i think they call it an influx or this crazy amount of work all at the same time that it is her doing like this morning when like three things happened at once the third being another email that i got about shooting for a magician in the city for his youtube channel kind of funny i know but it's like street magic and it sounds pretty cool and i'm willing to help someone else out and you know it could lead to some exposure i mean more exposure as well and you know it never hurts to get more experience with your craft so with that said I'm gonna go because I wanna go get a bag of potato chips in Rite Aid um, because I'm craving the lime flavored Lay's. And if you haven't tried them, you should. It's not an advertisement, but they are so awesome. And um, hopefully this is the first of many uh, vlogs, I'm gonna call it, because I think that's what it is. Um, yeah, so thanks for watching and Stay tuned for a vlog for my trip starting tomorrow. Thanks, guys. See ya.